Well, Chad, you found yourself down twice today, brought two goals from yourself, salvaged a point. Just give us your thoughts on the game. <clears throat> yeah, I thought the game was was um, slow at times. I thought they come to a draw or to nick a goal. Unfortunately, they nicked two goals. I think one was given to them, but uh, the other one was a good strike from the edge of the box, which you can look at all aspects of it, how, how we could have stopped it, but at the end of the day, it was a good strike. But I just think <clears throat> it's just disappointing in the way that we know they've conceded goals and, and we've conceded two rubbish goals as well, so is that it's a bit the, disappointing. Is that the frustration in the dressing room, that the, the type of goals you conceded today? Uh, yeah, and obviously the frustration is that we've not won the game when we scored two goals at home. Like um, We work all week on, on keeping the ball out of the back of the net and when teams are gifted goals and, and given easier goals, con considering the goals that we have to score, we never really get, get goals given to us. but. Um, like looking at the performance of the second half, you've got to take positives away. But like I said, it's it's two points dropped for us. I think. Is that the mood in the dressing room that you have? Yeah, two definitely. Points against, so. Definitely. Yeah. Just talk about your first goal. It was a great move, and like you said, the momentum was on your side after the, the break. I'm guessing you got a bit of a, a telling at half time, but uh, it soon changed your goal. And uh, yeah, it obviously needed a reaction in in the second half. I don't just think that was uh, the message from the gaffer. I thought like. Us as players knew we needed a reaction, um, and we got it. But to be honest, we, we, at the stage of the season where we are, we can't afford to be giving 45 minutes to anybody in any game, especially goals. So um, disappointment. But we've got Barnsley on Saturday, which is going to be a massive game. So there's a lot to a lot to work to this week. And there's a lot of pressure when you're standing there with only a few minutes to go on the penalty spot, 12 yards out. You kept your uh, kept your nerve and uh, slotted it past the goalkeeper. <coughs> to get that point, <coughs> a good feeling, yeah. two goals for yourself today. Uh, no, it was alright, um, <clears throat> obviously I practiced penalties and, and, and stuff like that, but uh, it was, um, I just waited to see which way the goalie went and then put it away really, so it was, uh, I know it was a young goalie and he would have been a bit naive and gone a bit early, so it was, it was, uh, it was a nice goal to score. So it was, and uh, the fans get going towards the end and you just heard, heard the atmosphere kind of growing in the second half wasn't it and, and again a bit like against uh, Accrington trying to get the ball into the back of net for yourself oh, yeah obviously you look at the games well we, we were begging for for minutes and obviously they were time wasting which is, is good play from them um uh, but I just think we needed to to be sharper in the first half and and stuff like that and I think you look at the performance second half we, we were sharper and we get our two goals like I said before we can't afford to to do that at this stage of the season and and if we wasn't in, in a real promotion push, then it would be a much bigger blow than it is today. Yeah, on, a, on a personal note, now 16 goals for you <coughs> for the season, very close to that 20 mark. Uh, definitely achievable before the uh, end of the season with six games to go. Yeah, obviously it's achievable. I think uh, as a team, we're creating more chances. The style of football we're playing. Um, I still think we can we can get better in the final third, uh, be a bit more clinical. Because if you if you see the amount of time we spend in the final third, especially in the in the second half today. We should be getting more more shots at goal, more crosses and, and stuff like that. So it just seems like it's not falling for us. Um, but it's for other teams that just it just drops to the, in the right spot and stuff like that. Uh, but that's something we'll work on. Ten points off the players going to Barnes the next week. Uh, still got hopes of uh, reaching the playoffs now. Yeah, I just think obviously we we got every game to win. Um, the way Gaffer is, he's not gonna he's not gonna take a step off the off the gas like so. It's going to be a it's going to be a hard game because Barnsley are a good team, but I think um, if we go there with the right mindset and and try and get a result, it's definitely possible.